Oh, there you are. Yep, I'm right over here. <clears throat> I found the spot I like even better. That spot. Mm -hmm. uh, the spot below us or the spot in front? Because if I'm looking correctly, that looks like either water or uncompleted chunk. This. Okay, this, this that's spot, water. This spot right here. This spot. Mm -hmm. uh, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Right here. Turn. Yep. Ah, Hi. Okay. Hello. Hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> so yes, okay. I know I'm crazy. This spot. This spot right here, this right spot. below us. Right below us. Uh, you do realize that spot below us is water, correct? I do. All right. Uh, <laughs> obviously you have an idea. So uh, uh, underwater. let's underwater. 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 Go on. <laughs> so we're building. We've decided for fun because in this glimmers pack, and it's nighttime, so I can show anybody watching. All of the mobs have been replaced with automatons. Yeah, automatons. Yeah. Automatons, and they're all a little different. Like this is a skeleton archer there, but so is this one over here. And there's zombies. And this zombie looks like a person from this side. That's a person, but no. Wait, that's walking away from me. Get over here. That is not a person. <laughs> and it's not a zombie. It's a disguised robot. And some of them are incomplete, like this. Oh. This this, this guy down here, who has no body and no legs and is just floating head and arms, which is pretty creepy. I like it. And even creepers no. are machines. And incomplete machines at that. Some of them. I found one that's complete. Uh, this one here is incomplete. This one's incomplete. So I thought, how cool would it be if we built a factory under the assumption that there was once a person or peoples, scientists, who created all of these... Oh, this one's cool. It's got glowing eyes. That's a zombie right there. Uh, that's kind of creepy. Yeah. Built a factory to create all of these automatons, but then the automatons went mad and killed off the factory workers. And now the factory is automated. I very much like that idea. So we were going to build the factory where all these automatons were made to explain where they come from. And we were going to build it out in the snow all the way over there, but then I found this spot here and I'm like why not build it underwater and have it like a secret factory like perhaps it was built on the ice but see how the ice is all broken mm -hmm. maybe it sank to the bottom so we could do a little bit of destruction on it and that's why some of the machines aren't quite up to code cool there's even a spider look this spider's missing some of its parts whoa look at that it's just a it's just a torso and legs. It's freaky when you look at it when it's on the ice. You can kind of see this weird glitch from the transparent body parts. Yeah. I That's okay, so I didn't I did notice that. You'll see it if oh, you yeah. punch the spider too. Mm -hmm. the transparent parts will light up. Oh, look and at here, that! Here's a complete spider. I've never seen one that looks like this before though. That one's pretty cool looking. And, okay, I guess he wants to swim. Apparently, they are waterproof. All the more reason to build this underwater. Yeah, I'm okay with that. So, I figure, let's build underwater! Whee! Everyone likes an underwater build. Okay, where'd you go? I'm just punching out some gravel. And this okay. spot is actually pretty level, so it's a good place to build it on. Because we won't have to do too much terraforming. Really just take out some of this gravel. Should be good. I hear you, but I don't see you. Um, do you have a night vision potion on? I do not. 
You should probably, well, I don't see you either, but you should probably mm -hmm. use a night vision potion. Night vision. Where did you Eight go? minutes. I don't see. Oh, there you are. See, I was actually under. Ah, much better. I was all the way over here underwater. Oh, okay. Ooh. Punch. Punch, 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 punch. Punch, 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 punch. Punch the squid. Punch. Actually, I'm not gonna punch the squid. Punch, punch. Not this time. We could have. Uh, he looks, looks way too happy. You know what we should do? We should have uh, like all the robotic animals. We should put spawners and whatnot in there too. Squid looks pretty cool. <laughs> Sometimes the squids don't have their tentacles though. Really? Yeah, I've seen a couple that they don't have their tentacles. All of these <laughs> ones, all of these ones are good. But every now and then they don't have their tentacles. Wait a second. Yes? Okay, this squid here is like suffering from like tentacleception here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, like that. Whoa. Yeah, he kind of... Kind of has smaller tentacles, but hmm. that's pretty cool because it's like tuning fork tentacles. Tentacleception. That's the sound they make when they swim. <laughs> oh no, night vision. That's ah, better. Need my go juice. <laughs> Since we're underwater, we should probably have appropriate uh, water gear on. Mm. Oh, why not? Oh. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. do, do, do. Oh. Is it pumpkin or jack o' lantern? Pumpkin. Okay. Actually, which armor is it that looks like it's got? Um, I'm gonna say it's the diamond armor. Actually, how do you put a pumpkin on? You just uh put it on in your head slot. Okay. Go away, leather cap. Oops, that's a command block. That's a pumpkin. <laughs> ah, cool. I put on full iron armor and everything, so I probably look like a deep sea diver now. Nice. It's actually easier to see than, like, wearing the actual pumpkin is really hard to see in regular vanilla Minecraft. Today's full coverage minus video is brought to you in Pumpkin Vision. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, that's probably the wrong sound. I probably should make like uh, underwater breathing noises, like ksh, ksh, dark Vader noises. Appropriate for today. <laughs> Most definitely. Let's see, how's it go? Sonar noses. Maybe the squid makes sonar noises. <laughs> Should we fill this trench in? Uh, sure, why not? Should we fill it in with more gravel? Ah, uh, sure. Yes. Oh, there it is. Gravel! These helmets are not going to last for very long. <laughs> <laughs> Just until the uh, novelty wears off. Yeah, and that's like, crap, I need to actually see <laughs> what <laughs> I'm doing. Come on, squid. Move. Fla swim up. <laughs> no, don't have a squid orgy. <laughs> 
I guess it's only two, so it's not really an orgy. Unless they're trying to include me. Move. Thank you. I had to punch the squid. No, no. Eh. Oh, now there's three of them. <laughs> now it's an orgy. Oops. I'm trying to include me. Do not want. Do not want. Robot tentacles. Get out of there. Go swim up. That's right. Go up. You do not want to get out of that freaking hole. You're going to die in that hole. I'm going to punch you to death. Thank you. These squids are starting to irritate me. They keep swimming exactly where I'm trying to put blocks. Why are they swimming down? They swim down. Get out of there. There, thank you. Really? Squid likes you. New game. Squid punchers. This one's trying to eat my face. <laughs> Do not want to be part of your squid orgy. <laughs> you trying to go all uh, uh, Zoidberg on you? He actually is. <laughs> that was a horrible squid. squid uh, yeah. Zoidberg? Yeah. Zoidberg. Horrible impersonation of Zoidberg. Uh, <laughs> I Close enough. Squid. Got in my way one too many times. This one has no tentacles. Oh. Okay, so I think I inadvertently killed one of the squids. I purposefully killed one of the squids. <laughs> well, I kept punching it to move it and it eventually just died. <laughs> I covered mine in gravel. I do it. Okay, I think this is all of it. Yeah, this helmet needs to come off. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, see. Yeah, it, it, it lost its novelty a while ago. Yeah. Now it's just kind of getting in the way. And back to your leather cap. Ah, much better. What the hell? Hold on. Malicious website blocked. But Skype is fine. Exclude. Thank you. It tried to block Skype? It tried to block Skype. Probably one of the advertisements. Could be. Oh, could be. Skype's advertisements have been ridiculous lately. Right. I especially like that it, uh, every time someone I, I start a message with someone or someone starts a message with me, I have to wait like 10 seconds for the advertisement to load before I start typing. Uh, uh, Gee, thanks Skype. I know you're supposed to be free and all, and I'm used to the advertisement on the top of the page, but it used to be like really quick. Now it's actually <laughs> getting in the way because I have to wait. And if I, if I put my cursor in first and then the advertisement loads afterwards, sometimes mm -hmm. my cursor disappears and then I type on nothing. Hmm. Weird. Okay, so this is where we're going to build it. Good. All right. Sky view. Good, 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 it's good, it's good, it's good. It's good. I say, like I said, let's build it like it 
belonged on the surface, but then it sank. So okay. it looks like a normal building with a proper front door entrance and everything. Okay. But then it sank to the bottom of the lake because all the ice broke out. <laughs> but it's still airtight and everything? Yes, because steampunk. It would be cool if there was like a, like a river going through the middle of it. Well, yeah, we'll work out some. Let's build it and then we can... Uh, I think the best thing to do would be to build it proper and then we can add destruction to it. Hmm. Because that's usually when you want to build something that looks damaged, it's best to build it in pristine condition first. Right. Then organize chaos the destruction. Yeah. <laughs> and I think it would be cool like if it has smokestacks and the smokestacks are peeking up over the top of the of the water level. I like that idea. So first of all, what should we build it out of? Yeah, I was wondering about that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My first inclination is to go with brick. Uh, brick. Any brick in particular? Brick, brick. Brick, 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 brick. Okay, uh, brick, brick, okay. It's a very factory looking brick. We could, uh, let's try nether brick. Let's see what nether brick looks like. Okay, that's a regular brick, that's nether brick here. The nether brick is, it's a bit of a darker red and the actual bricks are a little bit smaller. Well, it looks pretty good. It'll look ominous from the inside. Hmm. Right, so we'll go with nether brick. Okay. Very good. Do, do, do. Where is it? Do, 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 do. Regular brick. I still can't find anything in this menu. <laughs> I never could, honestly. It's not even the pack. I never could find anything. I'm always like, oh, no, where is it? There it is, nether brick. I know it's here somewhere. All right, so... Uh, I was thinking that since the ground, there's good ground over here, and it kind of opens up, so the front door would be on this side, so the front of the building would be facing that way. Ah, uh, lost you. Oh, there you are. Oh, I'm on the ground. So, like, it would have been, like, when the building was on the ice, you would have walked this way to get in through the front door. Maybe. Okay. No, I'm inside. No, I'm underwater. I am over here. Now I am down under here. Okay. And... I feel like it should be longer than it is wide. That's a good starting point. We can use that to our advantage and have some destruction in that corner. Okay, just found a squid with no tentacles. Yeah, there 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 are a couple of those. Hmm, wow. Okay. Come on, give me a block. Water build. <laughs> Something like that. Got two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. And I think that should do it. Yeah, that, that's that's good. Is that width or length? Uh, that would be width. Okay. And then I was thinking a little bit longer. All right, let's we'll see. We'll hit this corner here, but I kind of like that we'll hit the corner because, like I said, we can just do some destruction there. Like it fell down, and this part got damaged by the ground. Okay. 
maybe do it by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 30 back here? Yes. Hmm. At least it should be about 30. thing end up going back a little bit further, but... Ah, uh, we still could. May involve uh, blowing up some of this gravel here. Maybe. It's a bit more than I wanted to run into. I mean, we can still make this side damaged, but for now, let's, let's, let's say we go back 40. Go back 40? Okay. This is 30, right? So 31, 32. 2, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, and 40. Should have been counting that, but I wasn't. So it has to come from here. Oops. Again with the night vision. It's going to be a nice size factory. Yeah, I think that'll... That'll do. I don't want it to be too big. Well, we'll probably make it bigger. Could always go another 10 back. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Let's see how it looks. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Seven, eight, While you're doing that, I'm going to make an experiment. Twenty-nine, thirty. What? I went off. Got off somewhere. I'm going to experiment. Experiment away. Okay, we'll do that. We'll do that. I like oh, this. Yeah. We'll clear out some of this part here where you're at. Mm -hmm. And then back here we'll have will be the damaged corner. Like this whole side of the factory could be all bunged up. So do we want to take out some of the uh, gravel and the uh, hill and everything? Yeah, right where you are. Okay. You can proceed with your experiment, which I think I know what it is. You know me all too well. I also think it'll be a rousing success mm -hmm. if I understand water mechanics. Minecraft water mechanics, that is. Not real water mechanics. Those don't apply. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Fire in a hole. Okay. 
do anything? Uh, it didn't yeah. look like it. And it went up. Or was that already there? I think that was already... Wait, no, that wasn't there. So it went up. I... You, you blew a path straight up. Okay. Here's what I'm going to do. Do, do, do. I'm going to get jiggy. down into this stone here. Gonna get jiggy with it? Na 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 getting jiggy with it. <laughs> oh shush. <laughs> <laughs> A wise man once said, if it's worth doing, it's worth overdoing. Yes. Is that Adam Savage of the Mythbusters? Or was it Jamie Heineman? It was one of them. <laughs> They're both pretty wise. And what song were you humming a short while ago? All right. Fire in a hole. 90s song. Some weird little 90s song. Oh! 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 Well, that worked. <laughs> Oh, oh! 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 Well, that worked. <laughs> oh, oh! 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 Well, that worked. <laughs> that worked quite well. All right. Um, yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Experiment successful? I'd say so. Do it, anything worth doing is worth overdoing. It's originally from Mick Jagger, of all people. No kidding. Yeah. I'll allow it. Oh. I'll allow it. Sounds about right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. That was. That was awesome. I. I approve of what just happened. I think you've pretty much cleared out exactly how much we need. <laughs> no. Anyway. Ah, uh, experiments. I'm glad we didn't test that at the new warehouse. Mm. We wouldn't have the warehouse anymore. <laughs> How did you... Huh? How in the hell... <laughs> Did this sand get up here? That's what I was trying to figure out too. Like I think the sand I think the water pushed the sand up here. I think it did. I think the blast and the water pushed the sand blocks up here. <laughs> you moved blocks of sand with TNT. That's good to know. Might have to conduct another experiment sometime soon. Criminy, I think that worked a little too well. Okay. Just for good measure, I'm going to take a picture of right here. F2. All right. <laughs> uh, we can get rid of these. Yeah. Oh man. I 
apparently that blast pushed uh, pushed sand st uh, sand blocks over here. <laughs> wow, I didn't even know you can move sand blocks with explosions like that. <laughs> we learn something new every day in Minecraft. Um. Um. <laughs> they weren't here before. You actually cleared to the other side. <laughs> nice. Night vision. Okay, that was a pretty impressive blast. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. There's one over here. Where? Here. Uh. Wow. That's far. <laughs> So well, fill in the floor. Yes. You know what would be really nice right now? What's that? A fill command. You know? Mojang, get on that. <laughs> yeah, we want our 1.8. We might be a while because I've heard talk about a 1.7.10. Error. Yeah. And what exactly is going to be in uh, 1.7.10? No idea. I just know that there are uh, uh, user-generated stuff that is supposedly going to be compatible at 1.7.10. Okay. The spot below us or the spot in front because if I'm looking correctly that looks like either water or uncompleted chunk this okay this, this that's why this spot right here this spot hmm. yeah, where'd you go where'd you go right here. Turn. Yep. Ah, hi okay hello hi <laughs> <laughs> so yes okay. I know I'm crazy this spot. This spot right here. This right spot. below us. Right below us. Uh, you do realize that spot below us is water, correct? I do. All right. Uh, <laughs> obviously, you have an idea, so... Uh, uh, underwater. Let's... All of these automatons, but then the automatons went mad and killed off the factory workers. And now the factory is automated. I very much like that idea. So we were going to build the factory where all these automatons were made to explain where they come from. And we were going to build it out in the snow all the way over there, but then I found this spot here and I'm like, why not build it underwater and have it like a secret factory? Like perhaps it was built on the ice, but see how the ice is all broken? Mm -hmm. Maybe it sank to the bottom, so we could do a little bit of destruction on it, and that's why some of the machines aren't quite up to code. Cool. There's even oh this, this this guy down here, who has no body and no legs and is just floating head and arms, which is pretty creepy. I like it. And even creepers Not are machines. And incomplete machines at that. Some of them. I found one that's complete. Uh, this one here is incomplete. This one's incomplete. So I thought, how cool would it be if we built a factory under the assumption that there was once a person or people's scientists who created all of these? Oh, this one's cool. It's got glowing eyes. That's a zombie right there. Uh, That's kind of creepy. Yeah, built a factory to create. Oh, there you are. Yep, I'm right over here. <clears throat> I found a spot I like even better. 
That spot. Mm -hmm. uh, underwater. Underwater. Go on. <laughs> so we're building. We've decided for fun because in this glimmers pack, and it's nighttime, so I can show anybody watching. All of the mobs have been replaced with automatons. Yeah, automatons. <laughs> automatons. And they're all a little different. Like, this is a skeleton archer there, but so is this one over here. And there's zombies. And this zombie looks like a person from this side. That's a person, but... No. Wait. Oops, walk away from me. Get over here. That is not a person. <laughs> and it's not a zombie. It's a disguised robot. And some of them are incomplete, like this.